What's happening guys? Isaac here. Today I want to talk about your self-esteem and how it's incredibly important in your self-actualization or personal development journey. Now your self-esteem basically in layman's terms is your your what you believe your self-worth to be or your self-estimate, right? What you believe your self-worth is. And in order to be able to achieve a lot of the things we want to achieve, we want to ensure that we have a healthy self-esteem and not a negative or a bad self-esteem. See, people with bad self-esteems are people that beat themselves down, that believe they are not worthy of great things, that always look at the negatives instead of the positives. And people with a healthy self-esteem believe that they're capable of good things, that, that they can get better and all these positive attributes that we need that empower us on our journey. And one of the ways that we sabotage ourselves, one of the ways that we can mess up our self-esteem is by focusing on the downside. Now, what I mean by this is, what always happens when you start something new, what's always necessary is that you're gonna have that period of time where you're not very good at it. The period of time where you're learning and you're making mistakes and some of these mistakes might be embarrassing. Now, this could be through when you're asking a girl out for the first time or going in for the first kiss or perhaps you're doing the public speaking for the first time. Maybe you joined a basketball team and you're about to play your first game, your very first game in front of everyone. There's plenty of times where we are gonna fuck up and it's gonna be embarrassing. So what's important for your self-esteem here is that whenever you make a mistake, is you focus on what you learnt while making the mistake, you don't focus on yourself making the mistake, if that makes any sense. That is, you don't take it as an ego hit. You just focus on what you can gain from it. And you also focus on your achievements more than your mistakes. So focus on the times you were successful. Focus on the times when you actually did get that three-pointer shot on the basketball court. Or focus on the time when you did do that public speech that was excellent and everyone was applauding you, everyone was on your side. Focus on the upside, focus on the upside on your successes so that you can reinforce this idea into your head that you are capable of great things. And remember, focus on the lessons. Don't vividly remember everything about your failures. Don't don't put your ego into it. Don't make it an emotional thing. Just remember what you learned and move on. That way you have positive upside on both sides of the spectrum here. Now, I personally used to be one of these people that used to beat themselves down whenever I did something wrong. So perhaps maybe I fell down, something that was just an honest mistake, and I would be thinking about it for the next three days, replaying in my mind, seeing myself doing it, making it a very emotional problem. Once I stopped doing this, I was able to actually achieve a lot of greater things. Because once you get rid of this, low self-esteem habit and start taking more awareness into what's going through your mind and what you're focusing on, you can definitely start doing some damage. You can definitely start being more successful in whatever you choose because with success, there's always going to be barriers. It's inevitable. There's always going to be tough times. Shit's going to hit the fan and your self-esteem is what's going to ensure that you're capable of going forward and not moving backwards. Your self-esteem is what's gonna ensure that you make it to the top of the mountain, that you don't give up. So it's very important that you implement this simple habit that I just told you about, and you're gonna see all kinds of results. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. If you liked it, give it a like. If you haven't subscribed, why, you have, why haven't you subscribed? And also, please leave your comments down below so we can start dialogue, start talking about self-esteem because it's a topic I want to get into for future videos because it's incredibly important, so important. Anyway, see you guys later. Peace. Do it! Just do it!